Everything that I told y'all that was going to happen, it happened. Everything it went well. I'm back. Like, the schedule is back up. I'm able to get my kids starting tomorrow. What's good, y'all? Welcome to the channel. Welcome, welcome. So this is Jameer's Journey. Yes, I'm finally starting my YouTube channel. I've been wanting to do this for years. I'm talking probably about three years now when I was in college and stuff. I always wanted to do YouTube. It's March the 25th, 2024, 11, 20, and Jameer is starting his channel. It's about damn time. If you're new here, well, y'all all new here, so just hit the subscribe button because on this channel, it's, it's going to be a lot of advice. It's going to be a lot of vlogs, family time. I'm really recording my journey. And my journey is a lot of things that happens in my life and things that I go through that's real. And I'm a, I'm a kind person at heart. You know, I share my gift daily. So if you see me on camera doing stuff, you don't know me, obviously, but that's just me. Anybody would say that. They know that's just me. So I, I would never put on the front for a camera. And what y'all going to see on this channel is my true, genuine life and everything that I do. This is just flowing. Like, as I'm talking here, I'm not reading no scripts. Like, this is straight up Jameer. He's a bad man. Today and tomorrow is going to be, I'm going to do like a combined vlog. I got to go get a cut because, you feel me, I'm wolfing right now. Damn! I don't really be caring about haircuts, you feel me, because I'm secure with myself. I really only get haircuts if I got to do something, if I got an interview, if I'm going on a date, you feel me, something, anything like that, I get a haircut. But um, I've been really just grinding, working, 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 working. I don't think men are supposed to be just walking around looking perfect all the time. You got to look some type, you got to look rough because you a man. Huh? You got to take care of yourself, yeah, but... At the same time, like I know people that just wake like that get a haircut every single week. Why do you gotta get a haircut every single week? Um I don't know, man. But everybody gonna do what they wanna do, and at the end of the day, you have a choice to do what you want. And me, I'm I'm okay with woofing. That's just me. I'm confident. I'm myself. I love myself. You know what? I love myself. Even though I look like a burnt chicken nugget, I still love myself. So I'm about to go hop in the shower. Head to my barber, get my hair cut real quick, and then I gotta head over to Philly to pick up my sister from the um the hospital. She's at Temple right now. I'ma just bring this camera with me and let this first video be a little vlog. One hour later. start my day go get that cut first over to pick up my sister from temple and i'm gonna get back with y'all i get my hair cut in camden even though i don't live in camden no more you just got to be loyal to your barber like you can't be switching barbers like if you a man you know exactly what i'm talking about like, no cut! you just got to keep the same barber you cannot switch up i gotta say hello to my barber so but you about to go in there and get my hair cut and i'll be right back my ancestors rocking with me Keep the channel up and they the ones that told me I had to get out of feeling When you spread your ways, doing better things, niggas find a problem with it So we in the hospital, I'm about to go grab my sister real quick my barber definitely brought me back. Like, I think I got my swagger back. Oh, oh. But I'm gonna go grab her and then we about to head over back to Jersey. I'm about to drop her off to her house. And I'm, I might go skating tonight. I'm not sure. I might go skating. I might not. I'm going back and forth. But if I go skating, I'm gonna bring y'all with me too. So yeah, just stay tuned. Right 
Okay, so I just um, made it to Camden. I dropped my sister off. I'm about to head back home. I think I'm about to uh, go to the bathroom real quick because I got to go to the bathroom. Oh, and then I'm going to go skating for a couple hours because tomorrow is like really a big day for me. And um, I just got to clear my mind. Out. And I clear my mind by going skating and bowling, just doing things like that to keep me busy. So tonight I'm going to head over to um, Millennium. I might have my friend have him record some footage because I know how to skate. I'm just driving past the spot where I was raised at. Oh, look, this is the water tower right here. This park right here, it's like, this is where I was born and raised from basically my whole childhood. This is where I lived, this is where I played. I had a house over there, a house down there. But I wanna talk more about myself once that time come, you know? But I just I just went past that, um, that spot and um, I just wanted to show y'all real quick, but I'm about to head home and use the bathroom and stuff. And then I'll see y'all again. Two hours later. We made it! The oh, shit. Shit. Even when I fell apart, just to put myself together, find the lessons and the loss. Nope. I mean, it was a great skate session with the guys. I skated all my stress away. I feel good. Um, court tomorrow in the morning. I'll see y'all then when I'm getting ready. Um, and I'm going to talk a little bit more tomorrow. But yeah, it was a good night. The next day. What's good, y'all? Good morning. Today is March the 26th. It's the day I've been waiting for. It's a big day. It's the court day. I got to take my nieces to school. Then I got to come back get in the shower brush my teeth and get dressed and ready for court. I'm not gonna bring my camera in the courthouse cause I don't think you can. So I'm gonna talk in the car before and after the court session. I'm not even a suit person, but this is my first suit. So I plan on having like at least four to five different options, different colors, ties. And I got one standard basic look, but I feel like every man should have this one. It's a black, straight up black. You got a tuxedo shoes, coat to go over it. And that's what I got in my closet. I'm about to go get dressed. Well, I'm about to drop them off at school. Time for school! See y'all, love y'all, have a good day. You don't love nobody. You I'm... love your own self. Come on, love you. All right, so I'm back home. I'm about to get in the shower and get ready for court. <laughs> I'm ready! I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. Okay, y'all, so I just made it to the courthouse. I'm about to go in there, and um, I'll talk to y'all when I come out because I can't bring my camera inside. I know everything is going to be good. I know what I prayed for and what I asked for is going to happen. I know. So, yeah, I'll see y'all once I come out of court and talk to y'all about what happened and everything. If you got an iPhone, go to video, click the top corner, go to 4K and 60 frames per second. And this is what you get from high quality video. I know I'm confident that everything is going to be okay, everything is going to work out fine. We're going to come to an agreement and everything is going to be okay. One hour later. Everything that I told y'all that was going to happen, it happened. Everything went well. I'm back. Like, the schedule is back up. I'm able to get my kids starting tomorrow. So so happy.
happy, smiling, tears, everything. Like it just was a lot for me because this is something that really drove me crazy. Like not being able to be with my kids. Like I don't know about y'all, I cannot be long away from my kids. I was in a, a, a bad state, but nobody knew because I know how to put a mask on for real. I know how to smile when I'm hurting inside. <laughs> And I was hurting so for so long and every single day about not having my kids with me, not being able to see them, hug them, take care of them, you know, bath times, you know, I'm missing all that when it's, that's something I do regularly. I'm a full-time parent when I get my kids, you know? So not hearing the conversations, not playing, not hearing their laugh, not seeing them smile, not cleaning up the toys that they make a mess. All those things was literally just making me so depressed. <laughs> Order is in, the order got to be followed, um, and I'll get my get my kids tomorrow. Like I'm so excited, like, and I appreciate everything. I'm really grateful. Yes, I never had to go to court. I don't. I never experienced court this much until 2024. I just hope I don't got to put this suit back on. But I'll see y'all soon. I'm about to head home. Can't control everything but if you be patient creator will take care of things that you can't control that's what i had to realize as i started to lose my mind in a way i started to find things to keep me occupied i want to give motivation and be a, a voice to the people that um that's going through something they can't control but they don't have faith so what you got to do is you got to know that is coming. You gotta know that whatever you want is coming. Whatever you wish for is on the way, but you gotta be patient. The number one thing is patience. If you're not patient, then you'll fall into a state of mind where you can't get out of. And I didn't fall in that state of mind because I figured out that what I want is gonna come. So I just stayed occupied, busy. I started painting, started started the business. Then I did photography, just videos and stuff because that made me happy. And it occupied me during a time where I didn't have my children. So to anybody that's watching this that made it this far, that's going through something like this or anything in life, if you're in a position where you're at your lowest, you just gotta be patient and have faith in the creator. So yeah, I'm about to go in the house have my um have my moments and get out of this suit and i think i might talk a little bit about it and that's gonna be the end of the video i appreciate you if you made it this far um hit the like subscribe comment it don't matter what you're talking about i don't care negative positive if you got questions please comment below you're not going to make a mistake by following this channel because there's going to be a lot of things that will help you and it's, you're going to see a lot of things that's exciting and just I don't know, I'm a one-on-one, -on -one. like I'm just different. Like this is Jameer's journey, this is my journey and I'm gonna enjoy every step of the way and y'all gonna come along with me. Um, before I end it, I just wanted to talk a little bit about what happened with the court. Why did I go to court and what's going on? So basically, uh, me and the mother of my children had a disagreement. So she decided to keep my children away from me and filed an order with a motion to our custody arrangements and everything, which took 30 days to go into play. So once she filed, just had to wait. Everything got handled. The schedule was back going and stuff. I'm back to regularly getting them. We do a 50% parenting schedule, which I want to make a YouTube video on because I think it's really convenient and it works for the both of us. The first step was starting and I started my YouTube channel. I appreciate you if you made it this far. Leave a comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see y'all in the next upload. Peace.